Hey, how's it going? Gadalia Bloom from Nota BDS and now the, the Chamber, .coil, the Chamber of Commerce for Judea and Samaria, which I am standing here right now in this beautiful sunny day in the Shamron. Look at these beautiful, beautiful rolling hills. I wanted to send you a quick video, let you know what's going on. First of all, thank you so much for signing up. We haven't been sending a lot of newsletters to keep you up to date. I apologize for that. Uh, we're really connected with our, our uh, we're, you know, a lot doing with our Twitter page with Nota BDS, but our focus has really been the, the Chamber of Commerce of Judea and Samaria. If you don't know, for the last nine years, we've been working on uh, promoting more than 2,600 businesses in Judea and Samaria, fighting BDS, not just fighting BDS, but actually creating an environment in which any kind of boycotts or pressure is irrelevant. Because the only way to create a, uh, irrelevance is to make sure that we are strong independently and that these businesses here throughout this area have customers not only locally but internationally so that's what brings us to the chamber of commerce of judea and samaria again it's the chamber.coil i'm calling upon you all as early adopters you guys are signed up early you guys are are on board i hopefully you love israel you love judea and samaria you hate boycotts you love the jewish people and their ancestral homeland and you understand that in order to build communities it's making sure that there's a lifeline into these communities, which is the economy. And the economy is something that a lot of people don't necessarily focus on. It's not so, it's not so sexy, uh, for lack of better words, but it's important. It's a, it's a long term, the, the most impact that you could do for, that you could have for a community is to make sure that the, is that the, uh, the economy is strong. So that's what we're doing with the Chamber of Commerce of Judea and Samaria. I want to invite everybody to go to thechamber.coil and please do me a favor, read it over, look it over, spend some time. If it's something that you believe in what we're doing and that there is a long-term impact, which I certainly understand that, it, it, that, that there is, um, we want you to make a, a contribution. We are self-funding for the most part. We are raising a significant amount of money for the next two years. Short term, we're raising $30,000. We've gotten over $5,000 so far. Um, and this is gonna go into further development and uh, support that we need. Because this is really a, a people-centered operation. And so we need to bring on more people, more teams. And so with your help, whether it's $18, $50, $100, overall across the board, we, um, we could do it together. And this is our opportunity, although we don't have much to show right now, except, of course, nine years of promoting more than 2,600 businesses locally in Hebrew, we don't have much to show you about what we're doing forward. So we understand that we are counting on you to be an early adopter, to come in and to say, and to be able to say to your children, to your grandchildren in the next 25, 30, 40, 50 years, to say, I was part of that. And that's our vision. Our vision is not two years, it's not six months, it's not three weeks. We're 50 years, we're looking for another 50 years of development in Judea and Samaria, but this time much more focused and with much more impact. And so that's where the economy is. So please go to thechamber.coil and please take part, join us, make a contribution, stay connected, sign up also over there, and uh, together we know we can make this happen. It's only a question of whether this could happen if we're not together. But if we join hands together and you guys take out your wallets like we're taking out our own, again, we're self-funding, um, there's no doubt in my mind that we can make a, a much bigger impact than what we have been doing for the last nine years. So thank you so much. Uh, and again, go to thechamber.coil and join us. Have a beautiful day and I'll end with this beautiful view and my forehead <laughs> take care